At Central, our aim is to be a deep well that people can drink from, where they can find refreshment in a busy and a chaotic world. We're a non-denominational church. We're really relaxed, things are very casual. We sing together most weeks. We listen to someone speak. We do believe that God is alive and that the Holy Spirit can encounter us in the everyday and we seek ways to explore that, whether that be wild and miraculous or quiet and contemplative. The people who speak at Central are not there to tell you what to do. We're there to help engage your faith journey, the things that God is doing in you. We're not seeking to control or manipulate or guilt people here at Central, but rather help them grow into all that God has made them to be. We don't have a lot of programs. Life is busy enough for most of us. So we've deliberately stripped a lot of that back just to keep things simple. We really value people just having time and empty space in their lives, connect with one another and to connect with God. We do have some um, structured things in Central. We have some small groups. Some of them are regular and meet often. Some of them are just pop-up groups. We have a kids ministry that runs every Sunday. It's really important for me that one of the main things that our kids experience at church is that they just love being a part of church, that it's high fun level. They'll figure out the spiritual life in time, but I, whenever they think about church, I want them to just connect it with fun and friends. We eat together a lot at Central. Sometimes it's like everything in Central is a feast. In fact, even some Sunday services are just wrapped around food and we just eat together and tell stories. And on a Sunday, we'll have dinner together after church. This is because most relationships happen best around the table. There's not one way to be a Christian. We are a diverse group of people from different backgrounds. Sometimes we believe different things that are present in our you know, theology and our thinking, but we seek to love one another and to make love of our highest priority, to accept one another as we are, but champion each other to change and grow. So you're welcome if you feel like you think a bit different to other Christians and are wanting to explore with other people what it can look like to follow Jesus today.